Well, thanks. My name is Stephen Kadavid, and I'm the president at Kinetrax. Um, so today I'm going to give a presentation. Typically, I would give something a bit more technical, but I want to keep it light and fun here and discuss our baseball uh, system and how you can apply computer vision to, to baseball. Um, we came up with this title with Jeff Beer. I think it's a little strong. The word win, we don't win baseball games. The players win baseball games, but we do provide a competitive advantage, we think so, um, to the teams uh, so that they can make decisions regarding uh, how to prevent injury for their pitchers, as well as uh, to improve the mechanics of the pitchers and, and their uh, performance as a result. So a lot of people like to know, you know, how does a computer vision guy get into the baseball uh, field? Um, so it's an interesting story. I'll start off with it. One of, one of our co-founders essentially was an, is an avid baseball fan. Um, for many years, he had season tickets for the Philadelphia Phillies, and he was invited to many different events uh, with the Phillies. And one day, he sat down with an executive there, and that you know they began, start, started talking. And essentially, you know, the co-founder asked, "What would be the pinnacle of you know computation or having some sort of analytics in, in for pitchers in a game?" And the executive said if you could have something like motion capture that is captured within a lab, but in game and do that for our pitchers, that would be the pinnacle. Um, and you know, there was, there was a period of time in the early 2000s, I don't know if some of you may have seen the movie Moneyball, where the Oakland A's essentially uh, during the 2002 and 2003 seasons, they had a, a limited budget for their players around $40 million. That pales in comparison to the New York Yankees, who has something like 150 million on their payroll. But during the 2002-2003 seasons, they were able to actually make a playoff run, pretty deep playoff runs, uh, during those seasons with this very limited payroll. And what they used was what's known as saber metrics. So conventional player metrics were used to um, make decisions on quote-unquote diamond in the rough players. And that really uh, inspired the work that is happening now, which is called the post-Moneyball era, where more and more technologies, in particular computer vision technologies, are being applied to baseball to be able to extract uh, advanced metrics on pitchers. 